The plane didn't have air conditioning, but it had fans. My hair was blowing, it was so hard. There are all the gadgets and things up front. There were two screens. One that showed a map of where we are, and one that had all of our numbers of how high we are, the speed we're going, how far we're banking, and all that such not, what, whatever, what not, there it is. <laughs> so here we are in Baltimore, I just entered, there's the river with a few boats down there. On the right side you can see a 95, the highway. There it is, right below you. There's Locust Point, where I live. <laughs> you can see Fort McHenry out there on the end. Everything looks so small. You would think it'd be a bit bigger, but nope. Not the answer. We could see a lot of boats and things down there on the water. It was all so tiny. There's Patterson Park. It took us a little bit to recognize wh what it was. My dad immediately said, or immediately said, there's Patterson Park. And it took me a second to realize it. It's very large. The city looked really large from the air. It's a bit surprising. <laughs> Didn't expect it to be that big with all those buildings and houses. We went out away from the city to come back in for a loop right near our house. We couldn't get too far towards our house because of BWI. There is a uh, restricted flying zone. Like, unless you were landing, no planes could go in that area. <laughs> and that line was right through the city, so... But you couldn't go too far over. There's Joy Hill Park right below us. There were two towers, wow. the, uh, radio towers. I guess. Or not, not radio. Wait, hold up. Yeah, <laughs> um, radio and television towers. We were flying at about 1,400 feet, uh, which is 1,400. And 
those towers were about the same height as us. There's the map showing how we were flying back into Baltimore. There's the city again, the Inner Harbor. Railroad, and then in a little bit, you're able to see Raven. Oh, there it is. There's Raven Stadium, and we're right above Candom Yards where the Orioles play. Coming up on my house. And there's Stevenson Street. <laughs> so we're uh, that truck yard you see down there, uh, like a little bit in. Uh, but yeah, right across from the ball fields. That's that's our that's our block right there. Yep. And then right up at the top of my street, you can see my uh, or the South Baltimore Little League, where I play baseball. Wow. Thank you. So then after that we left out of Baltimore and headed towards my mom headed towards my mom's work because she wanted to see us. It was a lot of fun. So here's the video my mom got of us flying over her. You can see the plane there. Or, now you can't. Where is it? Anyway, she's outside of her work and saw us. We were able to pick out, um, we were able to pick out her down in the parking lot. But she said it was a hard to see us inside of the plane. Or even the plane's detail. The design of it. <laughs> After we did a loop around her, we were going to head back to the airport. There we go. As we were going back to the airport, we had to do a loop real fast because there were two military planes. There were or two, there were four, right, four. There were four planes that flew right over top of us. And they had the right away to land before we did. I'm pretty sure you're going to be able to see them in the video.
within the airport they called the planes the warthogs because they aren't the best looking of military planes. So there's the runway up ahead. We're going to know. Got washed out. It's hard to see because of the darkness of, we're well not the darkness, the shadow of the uh, cockpit and then the bright sun outside. By the time the flight was over, it ended up to be about over an hour long. getting lower and lower to the ground. <laughs> As you're coming to the ending of our flight and the ending of this video, I want to say thank you for watching, and if you are not already subscribed to me, do so. Here we are, and finally touch base. We are all relieved to be back on the ground. We got a little bit airsick. There are hangers that we had to go back to. Rather smooth landing. We finally made it back to the hangar after a great flight. Thanks for watching.